I would say there's probably two things I'm most proud of. When I started at Folsom Middle as a seventh grade history teacher, we were team, but there was very little technology across the board. Um, it was something that people were kind of frightened of, and a lot of it was new at the time. So during my 13 years at Folsom Middle, I went ahead and spent a good portion of that time bringing computers, uh, technology, all the equipment associated with new methods of teaching to that site for math, science, history, English, and all the electives. And it really made a big difference across the board. I really like to feel that I made it a little less scary for people who were not used to it. Um, and then I think the other thing is when I was hired here at Folsom Hills, um, there was a little bit of uh, decisiveness, uh, division I guess is a better word, about um, having a school within a school model with Spanish uh, being on one side and our core teachers being on the other. And one of the things I really strive to do is to go ahead and integrate those two groups. Um, and I feel like you know that's something that was very, very difficult to do. But at this point in time, we have an amazingly cohesive staff where that uh, division no longer exists. Um, and we've integrated the kids and the families the same way. So while we have technically a school within a school model, everyone is one. And that's really a big deal to me and to my staff as a whole. We really work to increase parent involvement and student achievement um, at Folsom Hills across the board. Uh, PLTW and our Spanish program are two claims to fame and I have teachers who work tireless, tirelessly with me to go ahead and really bring those programs to the forefront of the district. So everything you see in this office, and there is quite a bit, have been donated or given to me by my students and families over the years. Um, it's quite an extensive, extensive collection across the board. One of the things that's great about it though is there's nothing in here that's valuable and so if kids want to come in and play or I can use it as a de-escalation tool, it's a really wealthy um, set of tools to go ahead and have on hand. I'm looking forward to another 20 years with the district. <laughs> I like the fact that they can apply skills that they learn in all of their classes in creating a project and also solving real life problems. I want students, all students, to have the chance to create with their hands and to think and to be creative thinkers. And I think the Project Lead the Way program that we have in STEM allows for students to uh, become lifelong learners. And in today's world, when technology um, makes knowledge grow so rapidly, it's really important that we have that. Uh, what I've seen with my students so far is we're in good hands in the future, and I'm really excited to see what they turn into and who they become, and um, I feel confident that we're in good hands. Um, I've taught first grade, third grade, uh, middle school. Uh, it doesn't feel like 20 years. Right now, my students keep me involved. I love what I do. I love what I learn every day. I'm, I learn every day from them. So um, it doesn't feel like a job. And so the last 20 years has gone by remarkably fast.